Peer review and feedback, a critical tool in comparing and contrasting texts. Hello, English language learners. In this video, we'll be focusing on a crucial part of the reading comprehension process, peer review and feedback. When comparing and contrasting texts, it's not enough to just analyze and form conclusions. It's also essential to understand how other people interpret and compare the same texts. So, let's delve into the world of peer review and feedback, and learn how it can significantly enhance our critical reading skills. The process of peer review and feedback is a cooperative learning strategy where students review, assess, and provide feedback on each other's work. In the context of reading comprehension, it can help you identify areas of misunderstanding or confusion, validate your interpretations, and learn different perspectives. Remember, the objective is to improve and learn, not to criticize harshly. When comparing and contrasting texts, peer review provides a platform for discussion and exploration. It lets you see how others have interpreted the texts, what connections they've made, and how they've evaluated the differences and similarities. You can find out if others have the same opinions as you, or if they have picked up on details you've missed. It broadens your understanding and enriches your analysis of the texts. Conducting a peer review involves reading your peers' work, providing constructive feedback, and offering suggestions for improvement. In the context of comparing and contrasting texts, it could mean reviewing their conclusions, their interpretations of the texts, and the rationale behind their comparisons. When reviewing, focus on understanding the why behind their thoughts. This will give you a clear picture of their thought process and help you provide more valuable feedback. When giving feedback, remember to be respectful and constructive. The goal is not to criticize, but to help each other grow. Start by pointing out what they did well, then suggest areas for improvement. For example, you could say, I like how you compared the themes of the two texts. Perhaps you could also consider comparing the author's tone and style? Receiving feedback can be a bit intimidating, but remember, it's an opportunity to learn. Take the feedback graciously, thank your peer for their effort, and use their insights to refine your understanding and improve your reading comprehension skills. That's all for today, folks. Peer review and feedback is a powerful tool that can elevate your comparing and contrasting skills to the next level. So, embrace the process, and remember, every piece of feedback is a step towards becoming a better critical reader. Keep practicing, and happy reading.